what did you think of the CNO meeting? Well, I thought it was great. I, this is my third one, I think. Is that right? Mm-hmm. Three? And uh, I've come to CNO 1 and a CNO 3. And I think the thing that gravitates me toward it is you're not telling doctors another way to boil water. Mm-hmm. You know, like most of these meetings you go to, uh, and and you hear the speaker, and they're speaking about the same old thing that some yeah. other guy spoke about 75 times. And yeah. that's just not what the CNO is. It's you, you, you're making these doctors think outside the box, mm-hmm. you know, and and the people that are benefiting from it the most are the patients mm-hmm. because they get they get these doctors who look at them and they care about their, their TMJ and they know that that TMJ is connected to everything else. It's like, yeah. wow. Well, dentists are supposed to be experts at teeth, gums, and bites. And dentists, they've got teeth covered, they've got gums covered, but they don't have bites covered. Yeah. Because they, they throw a blind eye to the orthopedic end of it all. And this isn't just a TMJ course. It's a, a bite course, occlusion, and TMJ. It's orthopedic based. It's based on cartilage, ligaments, bone. All these things that influence patients' bites, every patient benefits. We, we show them ways to use measured metrics, ways to uh, reproduce events. We give them introductions to uh, MRI and CT reading yeah. of the joint, what that means to the bite. We show them digital occlusal analysis. We show them electromyography, T-scan, EMG, joint vibration analysis, all these different technologies. And we even incorporate the laser technologies in the higher end. Yeah, and it's, and it's courses. all, like you say, measured matters. Measured it's matters all is the model. measured. It's all numbers that you get that are facts. Yep. They're not guessing. They're not going, well, you know, bite on this and I'll, wherever those marks are, yeah. I'll take a bird and knock yeah, that off. We, 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 <laughs> yeah, exactly. We, we throw away the, uh, the dogmatic ink ribbon, the articulating paper. Yeah. Yeah, and we, we prove to them 12 to 38% accurate. We show them the papers. And then the T-scan, for a simple example, 95% accurate per the literature. Yeah. And most dentists have no clue. And they're always looking for reasons to say, I don't need to use that. I've been doing this, that, and the other all day long. Well, we found within this curriculum the cure for sensitive teeth, for example. Yeah. And it's related to occlusion much of the time, if not most of the time. So, and that's a big deal. Every dentist would benefit by this course because every dentist has patients with sensitive oh, I, teeth. I totally agree. So even if you have no, no urge to learn about TMD world, well, once you get through the CNO curriculum, you start realizing holy cow, a third to a half of my patients are TMD patients, whether they realize it or not. And they're the ones that I'm doing most of my significant dental work on. Yeah. It's a big deal. And, and you know a course is worth it when it's 6 o'clock right now. Mm-hmm. We're supposed to be done at 5. We're still going. And they're out. They're, they're in the back mm-hmm. wanting more. Mm-hmm. You know, and so, I'm having you know, to pull the plug in about 15 <laughs> yeah, minutes. Yeah. yeah. So that's pretty cool. Yeah. yeah. Well, thank you very much. Absolutely, man. Thank Better. you. Thank you.